Welcome to Gears Everything, the podcast ranging in subjects from sex to astrophysics. In this podcast, I don't have any answers or any proposed answers, actually. I do have a question, though, and I would like to have uh, your input regarding the subject of ambition. I've been pondering this for a while, and uh, there are several things that in life we may take for granted, uh, especially when it comes to business or self-help or philosophy, and one of them seems to be that we all need some goal or some ambition to work to. And I wonder if that is actually true. Do you need ambitions? Or can you just uh, pick what you want to do at every given moment in time and just do what you fancy? And uh, just think, okay, so this seems interesting, let's do that. That seems interesting, let's do that. Do you actually need to have any ambition? I mean, to be able to actually reach the gold, golden Olympics or some such, uh, you would have to have the ambition of reaching that gold, obviously. But reaching the golden Olympics, that may not be exactly what fulfills your life. Maybe your life is fulfilled by some very strict ambition. And it seems very American to me that you have to, everybody has to have an ambition and works toward that. And business is very geared toward this. You have to have ambition, you have to have a goal, you have to have like, what is your five-year goal from now? What do you want to achieve in life? All these things. But is your life actually better off with these ambitions? Or can you just think, I will be ambitionless and just take life however it comes and uh, do what tickles my fancy and just go with the flow and uh, do whatever comes up. I mean, in my life, I've been toggling between these two things. I've had some very, very strong ambitions that has taken me to those places um, that I wanted to go. And then I've had parts of life where I have had basically no ambition and just done whatever interests me at the spur of the moment. And and both seems to me like viable ways of living life. I, I'm, I'm hard put to actually discern what gives me the most fulfilling life, whether that is the parts where I've had strong ambitions. Like when I was a child, I had this ambition that if I didn't win a Nobel Prize in physics and was uh, given a big fat entry in Encyclopedia Britannica, that was before Wikipedia, uh, then life was not worth living. And that obviously changed uh, since I'm still living and I didn't get a Nobel Prize in physics and I do not have an ambition to do that anymore. Uh, and Encyclopedia Britannica has no ambition at all. So, uh, but life is... Uh, life, life was a lot of fun working towards that goal. I mean, I was uh, this geek going to the university and, and uh, you know, playing around in mathematics and astronomy since I was like uh, 12 years old. So, so, this, so that was fun. Um, and maybe that was more fun than just doing what interests me. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm actually very, very, it's very difficult for me to figure out which is the best, having ambition or just uh, doing things at random, uh, which is stuff that interests me. So I would like to have your input on this, um, because when I coach people, when I help people, either if, if it's, uh, you know, Olympic uh, athletes or people on stage that are going to be good singers or actors or whatever, or even uh, people just off the street, which I happen to, co to coach, very much is centered around what that person's ambition is in life. Like, what do you really want to achieve? And I help the person achieve that. But what if the person doesn't want to achieve anything and just want to live life? Um, I'm, uh, and maybe I don't have a good recipe for those people. So even though I have had uh, parts of my life where that has been the main sort of uh, way of living life, just doing whatever fancies me. So, I would like to have your input. If you can uh, comment on the uh, on the comment section uh, below in the blog post regarding this, that would be really cool. And uh, if you have some really strong ambitions, oh, excuse the noise behind there is the tram going in Oslo. Um, 
And if you have some uh, some strong ambitions that you would like to to tell me about, and if that gives you more zest in life, or or if you have no ambition at the moment and just live life and and tell me how that feels like, because I, I need more input to actually settle this discussion in my life whether you should have ambition or not or whether that is it is a given everybody needs ambition or maybe that's not such a truism after all so uh, please join the debate if you can and uh, or you can do it back channel send me an uh, email at uh, g uh, at isna.com g at isna.com or you can go to the blog post uh, which is at isna.org um, you will find the blog post there, which is this podcast, and then some text uh, surrounding this podcast. Uh, and then you can just enter your comments below that, because I would really like to know other people's viewpoint about this thing. Do you really need ambitions in life? Thank you. Thank you.